Did you know that you can control many things on your Windows 10 and 11 computer with just your voice? This works especially well in Windows 11. Let me show you how to start it and how to use it. Start by selecting the Start button. When it opens, you want to type into the search bar, Voice Access. Select it. You'll now notice there's a new bar that appeared at the very top of the screen. And you also see the command that it needs in order to wake it up. Right now it's in sleep mode. We can just go ahead and select the microphone and that will start and wake it up. What can I say? As soon as you issue that command, you now see a new box open up and it has all of the things that voice access can do for you. And you have a little guide. It starts with getting started and here are your commands. This little arrow to the side will give you further detail on each of these commands. You can wake it up, you can put it to sleep, you can get back to this menu at any time by saying, what can I say? Then there are tutorials on managing voice access and your microphone. Interact with apps. Interact with controls. Interact with overlays. Control your mouse and keyboard. Dictate text. Select text. Edit text. Navigate text. Format text. And then there's voice shortcuts that you can create. And of course, you can also visit online documentation. And if you want to have these always handy, you can download a local copy that you can then refer to or print out, whichever you prefer. Voice access is one way to control most of the functions on your computer without a keyboard and without a mouse. Just use your voice. If you prefer to control your device through your voice, take a closer look at voice access. Get familiar with the commands. Just a short little look at voice access and how it can help you control your computer with just your voice. Stay safe, stay secure. I hope that helped. Thanks for watching and listening.